to have to prime your face. So let's go in with the Honey Do Me Up. Someone asked me if this product leaves your skin oily and no it doesn't. My skin is combination. I have oily skin and I also have dry skin. My oily areas are right over here where you can tell the redness in my skin and then also in my T-zone. Um, I used to be super oily, super pimply. I'm not even kidding you. I had pimples all right here. My whole forehead was pimples and just mountains, oils everywhere. I'm not even kidding you. This was back in middle school. I didn't care for my skin. I, I was young. You know, I, I didn't know skin had to be taken care of. And now I know, now I have certain routines and in taking care of my skin. But that's a whole different YouTube video. So for this one, it didn't leave me oily. It um, really actually hydrates your skin. Honey Do Me Up just sounds sticky and oily and gross. But honestly, this product works super good. So once we're done with that, we are going to go in with, maybe we should do our face first. Hmm. I'm just messing with this as I go. Let's actually do our eyeshadow. So we're going to go in with the Beauty Treats. How gorgeous is this palette? It literally has every color you need. It's going to be perfect for Halloween. Okay, so... Um, it smells like makeup. Then we're going to go in with this peachy tone. I have a question for you guys. In my last video, did you guys... Do you guys prefer me doing the microphone or talking like this? Because sometimes I feel like I'm boring. This palette is $24.99 and it comes with 130 different eyeshadow colors. Morphe are $25 and they come with 35 eyeshadows. And same price, but you're getting more colors. And as you guys can see, the pigmentation is really good. This is my first time trying it, so you guys are seeing it up here. Like, look at that. You can see the color. I'm really impressed. I'm not even kidding you. Like, the cheap brands are actually really good. We're just going to go in with, like, a deeper red. It's going to be this one right here. And we're just going to focus this on this area. are going to be applying this all over our face 
So I was thinking, what can I use to apply red? I don't want to go to a Halloween store. I don't want to use eyeshadow because it's going to be too long and no. Then I was like, hmm, lipstick. Now that we kind of got like the section that we're going for, we're just going to be um, putting a, don't put too much because then it's going to get all over the place because I'm noticing that this lipstick, it's really thick. So just put a strip and just start blending down. I have to do it kind of quick because I've had it on for about like a few minutes because a customer came in right now. They were literally staring at me like, do you know how to do makeup? I'm just like, I'm sorry, honey. It's, it's for. Blend. I'm feeling fierce with this red. I have a feeling throughout the day because my skin is a bit oily on my forehead. It's going to start looking funky. So what I'm going to do, maybe you guys should do it too. Um, this is my first time doing it, so I'm not sure how it's going to be after. Get your brush and just get the eyeshadow. And just put it on top just to set it dry. This hopefully will mattify it. When we draw our lines, we're going to draw starting from the middle down. Drawing in your loops. So when you do it, just kind of swoop it across. Woohoo! We're going to outline our eye like this. So once you get to that point, you're going to make it a little pointy and then go down. And I had some red in this area. Before you outline, make sure you remove that red because on this side, I didn't do that and I had to go in with concealer, so just to prevent that extra step, remove the redness. And you're going to bring it down all the way past your eyebrow and then just make one straight point and stop right there. It's okay if it's thick, we're going to outline it again right now. And then for this point, we're going to go straight across like that. Oh, I'm kind of nervous. Woof. Good job. And then we're just going to bring it down. Hell yeah. Did I mess up? This side? Oh my god. Let's not even talk about it. So we're just going to make it thicker, fill it in. So I was just going straight down and it just looks, it doesn't really have like boldness to it. So what I do is on this point, you see how this side it, it's deeper and then it gets skinnier. This side you're just going to draw like a little triangle this way. Maybe I should get some more eyeliner. <laughs> and just kind of make it look like fade out. ombre lip duo this product works really good and they have different shades as well this one has red and black so I figured hmm ombre red and black let's do it so they um, I also saw them at the store there's also testers available just in case you guys want to test them out
and Like this mixture, I just look like, like diva. Tell me this would not look cute with a black bodysuit heels. Oh my gosh, girls, I got you. Isn't this cute? So please give me feedback and let me know if you want a different look or if you have anything in mind and I can go ahead and try to give you guys a different idea. So please comment below. I need feedback. That would be really nice. Thanks, guys. Bye.